in this video I'm going to be showing you how to teach your horse to fist bump. Just like any liberty trick, this may take your horse minutes, days or even weeks, so just be patient. This is what it's going to look like once your horse has nailed the fist bump. Use positive reinforcement. When doing liberty with a horse, I always like to use their favourite treat. But you can also use voice cues, a clicker or just give your horse big pats once they've done the correct thing. This is Whiskey and he has never done Liberty before. I'll be teaching him to fist bump so you guys can see the progress and process of teaching a horse to fist bump. He was being a bit pushy at the start so I gave him a little trot lunge before we got started. If you feel the need, you can just with your horse to settle them down before you do Liberty with them. The first step. The first thing you want to do is get your horse used to picking up their leg. Whiskey wasn't that good at the start but I kept going and he got better. Do this until your horse is nice and relaxed with you picking up their leg. The second step. Now you want to pick your horse's leg up and tap your fist onto their knee. Then reward them. After you've done this a few times, you want to take your horse for a walk as it will refresh their mind and keep them from getting bored. Once you've done that, you can get back to teaching them to fist bump. In Liberty, it's all about repetition. So the more you pick your horse's leg up and tap your fist onto their knee, the faster they'll learn the fist bump. Once you feel your horse is ready, you can ask them to fist bump without you helping them. This is the first time I asked Whiskey to fist bump without helping him. As you can see, he didn't fully fist bump me, but he still lifted up his leg slightly and that's exactly what you want to look for. If your horse does this, reward them with big pats and treats so they know they're on the right track. But always remember to be patient with your horse, even if they don't understand the fist bump yet. Eventually, after practice and practice, your horse will get there. In these videos right here, Whiskey fully touches his knee onto my fist, and I reward him with big pats and treats. Do the same with your horse. Knowing when to give the treat. Right here, Whiskey smacks his hoof against the ground when I asked him to fist bump. That is not good behavior, and you do not want to reward that. When this happens, you want to take your horse for a walk to clear their mind as they may be starting to get restless. And always remember to only do 15 to 20 minute liberty sessions when teaching a new liberty trick, otherwise your horse may become bored. This is Whiskey right after I took him for a nice walk. Teaching your horse the difference between hoof picking and the fist bump. It is very important that your horse knows the difference between hoof picking and fist bump, otherwise they could get confused and will want to fist bump you while you're trying to hoof pick them. Pick up their leg and pretend to hoof pick, then once they've done that good, then you can go and you can ask them to fist bump and give them a treat once they've done the correct thing. Thank you so much for watching, I hope this helps. Comment down below what you want to learn next and enjoy doing liberty with your horse.